it's an absolute soul crusher. The one thing standing between a man and a 300 game, the thing with the thing that comes down. He says he thinks it was his fault because he mistakenly hit reset on what he thought was the other lane moments before. When given a do-over, he rolled a seven for a 297. How do you think you should feel today, Bob? Okay, that guy's gotta feel like he's in heaven. He got on national TV, bowling. So what, a 300 game. He'll give another chance to get a 300 game. Oh, Bob, that's ESPN not any good. The man had a like chance that. at 300, and he was responsible mm, for mm -hmm. trying to reset the pins. Walter should feel sorry and bad the rest of his life. Absolute soul crusher. I don't know. I, I think, Bob, you should be feel thrilled. You made Showdown in your first show. But Woody Page is getting the win and the face time. He would love that. Happy trails to Troy Walker's 300 game. Troy Walker, one strike away from a 300 game. He Watch rolled this. it. The ball is in the pocket, and oh, then the oh, gate God. comes down, blocks the ball. Holy what happened? Cow, did you see on the do-over, he got seven, finished what with 297. Well, but Troy Walker thinks he might have hit the reset button by mistake. What is up with that? You know, it's a bad thing. I can see it happening. But if you and I or I miss a 300 game like that, we fall oh, out crazy. on the floor crying. He's got 15, 20 of them. He'll have another one next week. Trying to find out we messed up reality. Do you have any, Wilbon? No, no 300 games Career for me. high? Career high, 237? Okay, not bad. Uh, the honey bear. And then there's the perfect game that got away. Any bowler's dream, a 300, 10 strikes in a row. And Troy Walker was almost there in a bowling tournament in Houston. He just needed one last strike. Oh when this happened, the reset barrier came down. Look again. His perfect last shot blocked. Turned out he'd hit the wrong button when he picked up the ball. They let him try again, of course, but he ended up with a 297. Everybody's come down to check this out. Looking for perfection, 300. So um, over the weekend, there was a bowling tournament in Houston. This guy, Troy Walker, he's going for the perfect game, 300. And he's one frame away. He's on his last roll. It's a huge deal. Troy winds up. He goes, throws it down the lane. It looks looking good. Right before he hits the pins, the rack comes down. <laughs> One ball. Oh my God. Oh no. And it bounces off. Oh. No! Wait, so what happens? They reset, Troy gets another chance, right? And everybody's like, come on, Troy, oh, we're pulling no. for you. And he goes. No! And he leaves three no. pins. Yeah, 297 oh. was his final. The way he walks away after he throws it is just like, just kill me, please. Oh, like, it's so no. bad. Would he, have, would he have won like a car or something if he got it? No. I think you get like a plaque. Like a pizza? <laughs> yeah. Pizza. Every pizza. car won. Six chicken wings. <laughs> yeah. Come on, ball. Oh my God. Oh no. The incredible. It's not now, how about the bowler, Troy Walker? One strike away from a perfect 300 game. Here's the attempt. Looks good. Oh, it's a machine malfunction. <laughs> <laughs> and when snacking at the ballpark, Dave, it's always polite to share oh, with your oh, friends. And Mark. there you have it. Oh, Wild my God. And Mark Albert from 2013. Ladies and gentlemen, Hall of Fame the broadcaster, sportscaster, Barb Albert. Thank you. Congratulations, Barb. Thanks for having see you again. We'll be right back and wash out every uh, you need to meet Troy Walker. He's looking for a perfect game at a bowling tournament in Houston when this happens. Ball. Oh my God! Oh, no. <laughs> Holy cow! Did you see that? He was working on 300 on a demanding lane condition, and the rack came down right before the ball hit the pins. And there's a mechanic already on it. What is going on here? That is so wrong. <laughs> now Troy was given another chance. He ended up bowling. He ended up with a 297. <laughs> that's that's terrible. What, what's the demanding lane condition? And by the way, that's the Muhammad Ali of challengers to the butt fumble, right? Yeah, check out Not Top Plays on Friday. That'll be interesting. Sports Center Live from LA next.